Looks like a fake image of an explosion near the Pentagon caused some uh, financial dips in the stock market. A viral fake picture followed by a real dip in the markets Monday. The Dow now down about 200 points. The S&P uh, down about a quarter of a percent right now. The fabricated photo posted to social media seeming to show a fiery explosion near the Pentagon. Experts say most likely made using artificial intelligence. Look closely. See how the grass blends into the concrete here? Part of that black pole disappears behind this barrier, and the fence itself looks off. All of us, uh, both within the DOD and I'm sure in the journalism journalistic community, uh, have to take a look at these things and make sure we get the facts before we make assumptions. Experts and officials debunked the photo within minutes, but it only took seconds to spread fast. Retweeted by a Russian propaganda outlet, shared by another account with a million plus followers, and rocketing its way towards Wall Street. It's not just that they can create the image, but then they can put it on a verified Twitter account and have it go viral to the tune of millions of views in minutes. And now we've got the market moving half a trillion dollars. Part of the problem, the fake image was retweeted by accounts with blue check marks, including one pretending to be Bloomberg News, which has since been suspended. <laughs> that, that's funny. A fake Twitter account was verified because all you got to do is pay your bucks. Blue checks on Twitter used to mean the account really is who it says it is, but not anymore. Anyone who wants to pay that $8 a month can be verified, and therefore it gets promoted higher in Twitter's algorithm. People are more likely to see it. So basically anyone can pay to pretend to be anyone, and we get fake things like this. Experts warn this may not be an isolated incident for long. I think this is the canary in the coal mine. We are going to see more of this. We're going to see more disinformation, more fraud, and we are almost certainly going to see this interfering with our elections in 2024. Some tech companies are rolling out plans to put digital fingerprints on pictures so it's easier to tell what's fake and what's not, like Adobe today announcing it'll integrate AI into Photoshop. 